<laughs> What's up, everybody? We're back with another Mountain Dew review. This is episode, um, not episode, uh, episode. Mountain Dew review number 64. 64. Minecraft stack. Pretty crazy. What Minecraft stack? True. Uh, this is another and probably the last of the hard dew line. Unless we find the cherry one somewhere. Well, that got discontinued, so highly doubtful that that's ever going to happen. But X, X, you're dwear to doubt. True. Um, we have the four main ones, plus the Baja Punch, the Baja Mango. I'm not calling them Baja Blast, even though this, again, says they're Baja Blast. We have the last one to do today, and it is... Pineapple. Pineapple. What? <laughs> oh my god. Baja Blast Pineapple. <laughs> what was, what? He was not, he was not this unenthused about the other ones. Baja Blast Pineapple. Um, we already had a punch, we already had a mango, and now we got a pineapple. There's been many pineapple dews already made. Um, and they all taste the same. Yeah, but they taste good, in my opinion. I like them. Um, this one, though, I guess we'll see. Is the... Hold on, I gotta look at something real quick. Oh, no, they're different. the other cans. They're different. They're different designs. Um, these are pretty good. Um, but, yeah. I don't I mean, know what the fuck that one's... It looks like a weird cross between, like, a duck and a fucking lava bubble from, from Mario. So, anyways, though, let's crack this one open. Or Potabo, if uh, you want to use the, the like, super correct name. All right, name here we go. Them. Let's get this one a whiff. A little bit of pineapple, not really any alcohol, so that's a promising sign, I would, would say. It smells odorless to me. Oh, boy. Completely odor. You know what? I'll, I'll take the sippy. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Woo! Not bad on the first sip, then it hits you with a bitter aftertaste. Hmm, interesting. I mean, it's just like the other ones. I'm probably, I'm probably only gonna put this one like half a point above the mango one, just I mean, because this one's a little bit better. It's a little more. It's not really well mixed. It's more of a front load of pineapple, and then the back load is the yeah. Alcohol. It doesn't, it doesn't mix itself in very well. I mean, it, again. If you're talking about just the pineapple, it tastes the same as all the other pineapple flavors. I mean, there's what, the Baja Gem, whatever it was, the Maui Burst, yeah. obviously. It tastes the no, same. Baja Gold. Baja Gold, that was what it was. Don't you dare compare Mango Gem to Gold. Don't you ever do that so, in my presence again. I mean, it's good. Nothing really, like, again, nothing really super crazy. Um... A little underwhelming that they've gotten the same taste for all of them now, for all the pineapple ones, which kind of sucks. But like, I mean, start mixing some stuff in with it, guys. Honestly, I, like, though, I get it for this because you know it's an alcohol variant, so it's got an excuse to taste the same. But like Maui Burst and all the Bajas that are uh, pineapple are just clones of each other. It's really? a little infuriating at this point. But um. I don't know. I mean, it's pretty good. I'd probably give it a six or a seven. I'm gonna um, give it a five and a half. Slightly better than. Slightly better than. I mean, if I they don't say the only one that comes close to being like something I'd actually have on the regular if I was an alcoholic was the first one. Yeah, my my favorite one would probably be the Baja Blast one, like the regular Baja Blast one, um, out of the seven now because we're probably never going to get our hands on the black cherry one, sadly, um, which is okay. It doesn't really matter. But, um, you know, this line of hard dues, it doesn't seem like they're expanding with it too much. Um, it's been out for a while. This is only, like, the first time that we've really seen it had come out in our and area, though. I hope they don't expand it because... Well, uh, they can expand it if they refine it a little more and make it a yeah, little it's better. Yeah, it's a little rough. To put it bluntly, for for them to try and expand it right now, right? I I, mean, I still need to try the other four chilled, but it, it's probably only gonna like marginally improve my opinion on them. 
That's true, that's true. Like, I think this one has been the best example of them needing to improve them before they try to expand them, because it was just mixed so bad. That way, I would agree, I would agree. Um, so, though that's gonna do it, though, for this review. You Hopefully, if for the Hard Baja, Hard Baja and the regular Hard Mountain Dew line, uh, hopefully go back to that way we can quit wasting our just, money on alcoholic do and waste our money on stuff that we can just chug without having to worry about a hangover yeah. but uh if you've tried this flavor or any of the other ones i'd love to know your thoughts about them in the comment section down below and that's gonna do for this video so stay tuned for much more amazing content including more do reviews of the non-alcoholic sugar variants Till next time <laughs> see you guys later we're gonna go shower and sleep goodbye